This technique came from an idea, turning the uh, original illustration for Johnny Cash to Tyler, uh, and he liked it and was going to publish it. I hated it. I hated the original. And um, I was sitting in my studio, and I looked down, and I had a piece of cardboard that had brown packaging tape. And so this is um, the process came from this idea that the values and the color related to the packaging tape. And I just had the question, like, can I make this work as a medium? And I had an idea about what I wanted to do with layering. So I, I went in and I decided to focus on the young Johnny Cash, the middle-aged Johnny Cash, and the older Johnny Cash. And that he was really three people throughout his life, uh, through different careers uh, and different moments that were all essential to his, his legend. So the first thing I did is I took the packaging tape and I, I put it on a, a cardboard and I sanded it down and I, I drew on top of it with ink and I drew the young Johnny Cash. And then I completely covered that drawing so it couldn't be seen at all anymore. And I drew the middle-aged Johnny Cash and I repeated that a third time with the older Johnny Cash. All this was, uh, was prompted by um, a quote from Bernini that uh, he said, never have I felt an errant stroke. And I thought about that for a long time. I thought about his ego in saying that. And then I started thinking that maybe he meant that every good choice is only arrived at through a lot of bad choices. And I call this process law of averages because um, what I was able to do is I knew that there was good stuff in there. I knew there were drawings that I liked. I was able to start tearing the tape away to reveal the drawings underneath. And in doing so, I, I had these pieces that were made of tape so I could put them to the side and bring them back in when I wanted to. And another uh, kind of happenstance was I didn't plan this, but the microphone I drawn it in and I kept pulling back and realized that the, uh, even the corrugation of the cardboard beneath the original surface was in alignment with everything else I was kind of doing. So I carved all the way back to the, the under uh, surface of, of the cardboard.